Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel guys. Today I am going to get baby Luca dress for you guys and um, <laughs> I wanted to do a sit down video and just sit down and change him but it just requires me to have to put on proper attire and all that stuff and I just, I'm just like nah, we're going to see if we can do this crib thing. So, um, for those that may not know baby Luca is my full body silicone baby he is um sculpted he is the fin sculpted by lillian breville and he is um poured in the super soft silicone by claire taylor dolls um and he is painted by me and one day will hopefully be rooted by me um but again he is a lillian breville uh sculpt and i do love him ever so much <laughs> um i was sitting here and i was thinking to myself i'm like you know what whoa you know what i'm like we get away from the most important part of the hobby a lot of times because we get and i say when i say we i'm talking about me um I where what am I what am I looking for? Where am I looking for? Where am I looking for? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Um Lord have mercy. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah uh, crap. Whatever. Anyway, uh I'm looking for something. We get um caught up in so many things, um and we forget that the main part is enjoying the baby so i've been doing that um the couple there's going to be a couple videos that i might share that are actually old videos um some have been shared in the chatterbox um and some of the videos in the chatterbox i will not share um like story time i won't share that um but you know like feeding videos and stuff like that i will share um a few of those and some you know sometimes it's you know a week late a couple weeks late i really need to um to wash him and get him and finish matting him but i just i haven't wanted to to stop to do that and i just well i haven't had the time to stop and do it for one and for two i just I don't want to not, I want to be able to play with him for a little bit. So, it's, um, I don't know, it's kind of hard when you really, really want to enjoy them, but you need to work on them, <laughs> if that makes sense. It's, it, it is, it's just so, it's, it's hard because I, I just don't feel like, um, I don't feel like taking him, like, you know, I don't know, like undressing him and then I have to get him all prepped up to work on again. And it's just for me, it's like I could just play with him now. I'll do all that later. Um, so he's not fully mad at, but it's okay. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh. Yeah, getting this little one dressed, dressed, dressed. So, right now, um, I only, like I told you guys, I only have the three silicone babies. And the rest are my vinyl babies. And I am going to be expecting more vinyl babies. I've gotten to the point where I am so, 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 so in love with so many different sculpts. So, I... I can't stress enough, guys. If you guys are, like, wanting to own one of my babies in your collection, um, be patient with me. Once I finish my custom orders, I, you know, like I said, I can't rush them. Um, but once I finish those, I'm going to be painting a lot of different sculpts. 
and there's no way that I'm going to keep all of them. So those that I don't keep will be available because, like I said, I just can't keep them all. But I have so many. And I prefer not to say who I'm painting, when and what, because what happens is when I do that, um, I do end up, and, and not that I don't appreciate it, it's just that I start to feel a little pressure to uh, work on them or finish them. Um, but I do start to get an influx of um, messages, so I want to... And, you know, it's that thing where you love to know that there's an interest for the baby. But then you're kind of like, oh boy, I got to finish it because, you know, these people are waiting to see. So, I'm kind of like holding out a little bit on who's up next. But I think the next baby you guys will see completed will be... Um, Felix, which is a uh, custom, and then the next one will be the giveaway baby, which is 85% um, done. Yeah. Um, and with silicone, it's kind of tricky. <laughs> I always say that, but people. I think people will think I'm just saying it because I want to make it sound like more than what it is. But I love that so many people are actually painting it for themselves. And they're getting to see that um, painting the silicone isn't as simple as it seems. It starts out when you first start out and you start painting, you're like, oh. This is not that bad at all. That's what you think, right? So you start, you you feel like, you start second guessing like prices and stuff. You're like, why are they charging all this money? It don't even take all that, you know? But then when you start running into situations and issues and um, when you do it a couple times, you're like, okay, this is why silicone it's more expensive this is why it takes longer you have to slow down you have to really concentrate um you have to think it through um and then you kind of at that point you realize that yeah it is a lot to the silicone <laughs> so i don't know if you guys can see him oh yep you can i brought him some hats that one, I know it's not going to probably do him much, much justice. Let's see. I don't know. You might be okay with that one. But because his, his head is kind of on the smaller side, the little hats like that don't really do him as much justice as putting him on a big hat. But it's kind of like hot here. So I don't think... He needs to wear a big hat, but he would be so cute with that hat. <laughs> I think he'd be so cute with that hat. And I could put him on some socks or some other, like, brown socks or whatever. But I think he's, like, super adorable. Let me show you guys. Like, <laughs> I think he's adorable with the, uh... The little Eskimo hat. <laughs> Let's see. You guys can see more of him. He's so funny. But yeah. But anyway. That is baby Finn. And I am going to. I'm going to take him some pictures of course. For Instagram. Hopefully these pictures save. I had spent almost an hour. One just taking photos the other day and um, for whatever reason, I, I I don't know, it just, I didn't, they wasn't deleted either. I really wasn't snapping or what was the problem, but it was like the most beautiful pictures I ever taken 
of um, major in Aspen and I like almost cried. You hear me? Like I almost cried. I'm still trying to figure out what happened. Like I'm just in disbelief that all my time and efforts went to waste. And there's no going back because the sun was just right. You know, I had natural sunlight. I had the time to take the photos. It just, there's no go back. I can't even do the photos over. I don't even remember the poses. So, I mean, like, Major was looking so freaking real. Like, he literally looked like a real baby in those photos. And I was just like, oh, my God. I mean, I was not using flash, so it was showing his natural color. Everything was so perfect. Maybe it was just too perfect. Anyway, thanks guys for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And I appreciate your support. Bye-bye now.